shit. It's one of these stupid things. It's the centipede asshole. Wow, he got like glitched into the ground and couldn't do shit. Is this something I can chop my way? Oh, no, it's a wall. That is a wall. Can't really chop through that too well. Kind of need a pick. Oh, look at that. Look at that trap. I heard it. I heard it. I knew it was coming. That's why I stopped and put the shield up. Oh, now there's more shit. Might as well sneak around for a little bit and try and try and get that increased as much as I can. Since it'll be easy to it'll be easier to level up with stuff like that. I can also do other stuff to level up quickly. There should be a lever here somewhere. I can do quite a few things that have that I haven't really focused on to to level up decently quick. Bandit Marauder. Something very magical was around here, fucking shit up. Ooh, look at that. I'm gonna take that. Uh, you can you can keep most of this stuff. I don't have a loot. This must be all the shit they stole from them. What is this? The Wolf Queen. That doesn't teach me anything. I will take the ruby, though, and I will search this chest. Uh, there's nothing too great in there. Eh, this just must be all the stuff they've stolen over time. They just kind of store it here. Stamina poison. That was probably the whole cave, too, for the most part. Yeah, that, that, was, that was pretty much the whole cave. Now, there must be some lever... Or button slightly hidden over here that I need to get the hell out of here. I just need to figure out where in Carmen San Diego is at. Otherwise, I'm gonna be stuck in here. So once again, I have no idea where this stupid thing's at. It's probably up there. Let me go. Let me go look for this damn thing. During the little fast travel spree, I came to town to sell some stuff and realized that I could not increase my smithing by just talking to this guy anymore and having him do it despite the crazy amount of gold it was costing and for the last I don't know 15 20 minutes I've been running all over Skyrim to get materials to craft stuff which you know in reality I would have rather have just paid over time to get it rather than spending 20 pure minutes of running around to get shit to to craft it so I'm finally up to a hundred smithing and I leveled up, which is great. So now I can sell the rest of this leather to this White guy. Belongs to the true blah, blah, Sky. blah. God so yeah, people were, you know, yelling, Oh, you should just, you know, go ahead and smith leather stuff or the daggers or whatever. And in all honesty, I would have rather have just paid the guy five grand a pop so that I wouldn't have had to have done that. But it's whatever. So now I can sell this stuff. And coincidentally, while checking my stuff, I had this dragon plate helmet, which I'm not sure is the dragon armor that I'm trying to get, though I can assume so. I mean, I I would I would like to assume so, that that is indeed it. So I'm gonna go ahead and mm -hmm. level up, and because I've leveled up, I'm gonna go ahead and get 500 health, a little bit over 500 now, and I'm going to increase my smithing to the dragon armor. Can create dragon armor at forges and can create glass. Requires 70. I'll go ahead and do this. There you go. That's what I want. That is what I want. Now what is this? Steel smithing. Okay. It's really nothing that I want to do. So now we can go ahead and create dragon armor. Which not too long ago I just went ahead and upgraded all my shit to Daedric. Which I guess doesn't really matter. I assumed I would have the Daedric armor a little bit longer than than I had, mostly considering I was just going to occasionally buy the uh, the smithing training from the guy whenever I had enough gold, but when that wasn't available, I figured That's I might as well get this out of the way now. But now we can make dragon stuff, which Daedric is still, like, ahead for some reason. I don't... Is Daedric armor better than... I thought dragon armor would be the best. Well... Let's see, what is the hel- oh, I do have the helmet. Well, that's crazy. I need leather strips, dragon scales, dragon bones. 
Okay, so I need a bunch of leather strips, which I kind of already have. I don't claim okay, to be the best. Well, let's let's see what this stuff looks like. Can I improve the Daedric stuff again? Let's see. No, I got. I guess legendary is the uh, tip top of the uh, the totem pole there. I guess legendary is the highest you can do. Maybe I'm incorrect, but whatever. I need to go get these dragon scales and bones that I have in the house, and then we'll see what this armor matches up. I figured dragon was gonna be the highest, just because of what people were saying and and whatnot. So I guess I'll go ahead and grab like. Oh, whoops. Sorry. I'm, I'm so used to putting them in the chest instead of taking them out. I have 51 and 61, which is... Oh, fuck. I just took everything. I just took everything in that chest. Uh, I can't remove that. Can put that back. Put all the, that stuff back. Burn book. Put that. That is apparently a quest item. Okay. Dragon bone. I guess I'll go ahead and put like... We'll go ahead and put, like, that many back, and then I'll go ahead and put, like, that many back. Ebony Claw. I'm still carrying, like, way too much shit. This sucks. This really sucks. I don't know, like, what's... What's weighing me down so much. I'd assume it's just all these scales. But even now, I'm still, like, vastly overweight. Let me figure this out. So I'm slowly making my way to the forge because I'm carrying too much so we'll get there one day Got some good pieces but I guess I'll just make buy. some dragon More shit inside. and see how that goes now we can go down to dragon and I can make let's see dragon scale armor dragon plate armor one's heavy and one's probably light yep light half of this shit is light which I don't want and the other stuff is all heavy which is what I do want However, there is no, like, dragon mace, apparently. Which kind of sucks. But whatever. You now we can go ahead and craft this shit. See what's going on. I need... I don't have the helmet. Well, I have the helmet in my inventory. I'm probably just going to sell the I other helmet. Because be it's... I don't know if Your it's what I want. It's got a lot of magicka on it. Let's see. That's up to 240. This Daedric stuff is 253, though. And that's legendary. So the Daedric stuff is still better. Dragon plate boots would be a hundred. That's a hundred and three. I might as well just keep the fucking Daedric stuff then on the gauntlets. Yeah, it's like the Daedric stuff is is a little bit above all of the uh, the dragon stuff. I might as well just keep the Daedric stuff. What the fuck? What is the point? Yeah, what is what is the point? Fuck that. I'll just keep the I'll just keep the Daedric stuff then. And, uh, let's go along with that. Alright, well anyway, back to continue on this quest. I'm rather disappointed with the, uh, the dragon armor. Figured it would be a little bit better than the Daedric, because it took a hundred smithing to create, but alas, for whatever reason, that is not the case. And there's no sort of dragony weapon. But it's, it's whatever. Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll happily wear oh, the Daedric the armor. Murderer returns. And the gourmet? He's dead. You're in my personal space, though. So I gathered. It seems a certain orc has disappeared. Which means you not only killed the gourmet, but disposed of the body as well. Oh, you've got the writ of passage, too, I see. Splendid. Splendid. Ah. And word has come in from Markarth that the Keep's cook has met an untimely demise. Yeah, I did everything you said pretty you well. Perform your duties to the letter. Thank you. <laughs> I was wrong about you. I see that now. Maybe we all were. Damn straight. Here's your payment. And a little something else as well. From me. Consider it my way of apologizing for being so damn curmudgeonly. It's called the Night Weaver's Band. I wore this for years. I want you to have it now. It'll give your magic and sneakiness some much-needed oomph. Now, you'd better get a move on and see Astrid. It's time. Time for the final stage of this grand and glorious operation. Yeah, because we all know how much I love, you know, magic and sneakiness. 
still here. I'm oh, sorry. What's the matter? You, you, you eating this? What I'm throwing your way? You eating this stuff? Sorry, douche. Couldn't couldn't hear you over me knocking all your food on the ground. What a jerk. I don't even know what curmudgeonly means. I just I just assume that it it's a synonym for doucher. There you are. Look, I, the hell? I just wanted to say thanks for coming to find me back in Dawnstar. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, you, just, you just talk to yourself while I leave. Anyway, what's up? So it's done. You've killed the gourmet. I sure did. And now Titus Mead the second is as good as dead. Sure will be. Oh yes. And I've decided you will have the honor. That'd be kind of crappy if they were like, well, you know, someone else is going to do it, Quest End. Oh, I have the utmost faith in your success, believe me. So let's begin. Go now to Castle Dower in solitude. Present the gourmet's writ of passage to the officer in charge, Commander Marrow. I'm sure you remember him. I totally do. You'll gain unrestricted access to the kitchens, and then the Emperor. You're posing as a chef, so you'll be able